good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm in the Glowforge software. And if you're looking closely, they've got something called Glowforge Premium. So, my friends, let's get cracking. All right, because of Glowforge Premium, we can just create a blank design right from here. You can see I've got a little bit of acrylic in here, and I made a get cracking keychain. Let me show you how easy it was to do it. All right, friends, let's start by clicking on text. I'm going to make a keychain for my daughter, Anna. Let's type Anna in here. You can pick any of the 900 fonts. I'm going to play with this one, Racing Sans 1. I think it's going to be a really nice font. Uh, you can stretch it. You can see right now it is linked, so it stays proportionate. I've been making keychains about as thick as that clear area, so I'm going to just stay with that right there. And then here is the magic part. You can create a new outline instantly. So the shape was selected, the outline is selected. It went six millimeters around it. I'm gonna change it to seven and just press enter. Notice it gets a little larger instantly. I'm gonna click on that outline and I'm gonna move it just a little bit and I'll show you why. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move it to the right so it still fits, but I've got more room for the hole that I'm gonna add with a shape. When you bring in the shape, still linked proportionally, so if I just type 5 and press enter, it gets to the right size. If you move over it, you don't want the scale. You want to get that move measurement. Sometimes I click away, and then the first time I grab it lets me do that better. I'm going to put it in the corner I want to cut. And now let's change some settings. So I found that cutting this acrylic, and mind you, your acrylic can have different numbers. If I do three passes 150 speed 100 percent at the seven millimeters it cuts pretty well i'm going to do that again three 157 and then i'm going to go to my words and the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to score them one pass 300 for the speed and then 40 for the power but then I'm going to click on that shape and do control C and control V to get a second copy. And then I'm going to take the second copy and I'm going to zoom way in so I can line this up as perfect as possible. And with it lined up, I'm going to switch the second one to an engrave. And when I engrave it, I'm going to start with my 1550, but I'm going to get in there and tweak it a little bit. For my lines, I'm only going to do 30, one pass, I'm going to change that to 9 millimeters, and then I'm going to call it good. So if we back out quick, we're going to cut an outline, cut a hole, do a cool engrave, and then also score it so it looks a little bit neater. I'm going to change my material. I am using 7 millimeter thick acrylic. Then I'm going to zoom back out so I can align it grab everything real quick and just nudge it up I'm gonna try and get it to fit so I'm gonna unlink this shape and I'm gonna make this thinner so it'll still match the areas and then I'm gonna just bring these both down so they fit in so once again I'm trying to line them up as close as I can I'm happy with that I can still squeeze this down a little and then that fits in nice and nifty so my friends, let's hit print and see what it does on the Glowforge. All right, friends, so let's see what we made. There, my friends, is the awesome little keychain. How slick is that? All righty, friends, there you have it. In just a couple minutes, boom, you've got your own awesome keychain. I made mine out of acrylic, but you can make them out of wood, whatever you want. With the built-in steps, it is so crazy easy and so epically awesome. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.